All right, today is Sunday, December 18th. We went out and did a little bit of crappie fishing today. Um, didn't catch a bunch, but we got some to make a video with. Water temperature is in the upper 40s to lower 50s. Air temperature is in the lower 30s and windy. Hope the video comes out good. Catching crappie in 30 foot of water in the tops of trees. What we're using today was, of course, the uh, 10 foot precision jig, Whitey Outlaw, uh, Catch the Fever uh, rod, 10 footer. I was using the grass shrimp south river baits with a 32nd ounce head on it five pound test fluorocarbon also using a little split shot to get it down on the top of the trees as fast as i could and that's our setup for today i uh, hope you enjoy the video um, don't forget to subscribe to my channel hit the like button any comments would be greatly appreciated also live scanner is offering a promotion not for sure how long it's going to go uh, they didn't tell me, but they did send me several promotion codes. Everyone's different. $50 off and free shipping on any live scanner. So today, now's the time to buy it if, if you're wanting one. All you got to do is send me an email to livescanner at standstonefishing.com. That's livescanner at standstonefishing.com. And I will send you a promotion code that you can use to place the order with. So, hope you enjoy the video. Like I said, didn't catch a lot today, but um, just, you know, we did what we could. So, anyway, hope you enjoy the video and hit the like button. It would be greatly appreciated. All right, guys, I just wanted to show you what this looks like. I just went under a bridge that's uh, around 30 foot of water. And if you can see all of that bait and those fish see those fish now i don't know what kind those are you know they're they're a bit larger fish i'm not for sure probably catfish but you can see fish up in here if you go over here to the uh side scan you can see them here bait and fish there's one there's one you can kind of see them that we just went through we're stopped here we're gonna go over here and see if we can uh, catch some of those fish. Let me also show you what it looks like on the uh, flasher. Okay, you see these? Those are all fish. We're we're right at, you know somewhere right in here we're around 26 foot see that dark spot and all of that's colored in red for really good returns those are fish and bait from a flasher i use that flasher quite a bit just to, to look for bait most of the time and i got the uh, vexilar set at 40 foot scale so zero to 40. So we're gonna look right on here. All right, this from zero to 20 foot would actually be the 20 foot scale right there. And 200, if you move it to 200, then this is 20, 40, you know, 80, you know, 100, and so forth. So as you can see, um, that we're right at the, uh, there's so much bait in here that actually it's kind of hard to pick up the bottom, but the bottom is right around right in here at the hot, that right here, and all that it's picking up a lot of stuff on the bottom. you can see so we're gonna move it back down to to sorry we're right back down in there and you can see everything we got in here so we're gonna go we're gonna go see if we can catch some of those all 
There he is. that one. South River Bates. Little one. Alright, we're going to drop down. And that tree. See if we can get them to hit. There he is. Small, but they're fun. doing take that live scanner and I'm aiming it right at that tree I see a bunch of them in that tree so what we're gonna do we're gonna go right back down in that tree now what I can do I can move that live scanner around to follow my jig. See if we can get them to come up out of that tree. There they are. There he is. Got him. They can't help themselves on them South River baits. back down in there. We'll stop it right up above the treetop. There he is. They're eating that grass shrimp color up. That grass shrimp stinger. to uh, put a drop shot on to get the bait down. I had to downsize the, uh, the uh, jig head. I've got the uh, grass shrimp stinger. South River baits. I'm using a 30 second jig, five pound test fluorocarbon. And I've got a little number, I believe it's a number seven or drop shot or number five, one, number seven, maybe, to get the bait down faster. All right, we're going to drop right down in the top of that tree. Pump my live scanner around just a little bit where you can see the jig fall. Try 
try to work it over here. Right there. There he is. You gotta keep the bait above them. These crappie like to feed up. They don't like to feed down. Alright, that's a little bit better. A little bigger one. Eating that grass shrimp up. Eating it up. There he is. Taking me a while to get a bite. I had to put the grass shrimp back on the stinger. <laughs> 